Hello, welcome back to Metalhead Nation Garage. I'm Chris, your host. Hey, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hey, uh, we're going to talk a little bit about Creed. Uh, I've talked to him on... Uh, Oh, it's been probably a month ago, six weeks ago, had an episode on Creed, uh, and, uh, at that time, Tremonte was out talking that, you know, there's no need for a Creed reunion right now, he's good where he's at, but he said he don't rule it out in the future, so, uh, the original, uh, well, the singer's out doing, uh, some interviews now, uh, Scott, staff, and he's, uh, you know, taking the blame for Creed's uh, original split, you know, uh, at that time, you know, the, oh, they was burning up the charge, uh, you know, hit after hit, very successful. But uh, at that time, you know, he said, Scott said he's living a rock star life, you know, and uh, and it kind of wasn't adding up to the hits they was uh, uh, putting out, you know, biblical lyrics uh going on there and uh not that it's a bad thing but he just wasn't living that life and he said that uh, you know the band you know they kind of had an issue with it they really never had an issue with the hits and the singing but it was just a personal life and the living you know scott said he was living the rock star life you know uh so that would be you know whatever you know substance abuse uh you know uh women, you know, groupies and things of that sort. But, uh, and Tremonte said, he, you know, nobody really was arguing except for him and Scott. So, uh, that was it. You know, there wasn't no, uh, creative issues. It was personal. So, uh, you know, and, uh, and that was the downfall of Creed. But, uh, look out because they are starting to make some interview rounds and they have talked about a reunion. They said it's in the future, not right now. That's Tremonte. But uh, you never know in these interviews going around. So look for something to happen in the very near future. And that'll be this episode on Metalhead Nation Garage. Hello. Welcome back to Metalhead Nation Garage. I'm Chris, your host. Hey, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hey, we're going to talk a little bit about Pantera today. Uh, the longtime Pantera engineer, bass tech, and friend Sterling Winfield, you know, he talked about uh, this Pantera uh, reunion. Um, they, uh, they've been working on this for quite some time, uh, at least two years. Uh, you know, and you know, this, uh, this uh, Pantera, it includes, uh, you know, Rex Brown, of course. And uh, so, uh, him and Phil, they've been working on this for quite some time, just getting the right people in, you know, um, doing interviews, doing uh, tryouts and things of that sort, you know. And uh, so, you know, doing dress rehearsals, things of that, you know. So they kept it kept it quiet for a little while there. So uh, a couple years, that's that's. That's big news to keep stuff quiet in the music industry. Usually it doesn't go that long. But, you know, they're you know, touring right right now that, to uh, really good uh, reviews. I mean, Zach's on it with the guitars. Uh, you know, Phil's voice is great. So uh, everything is uh, going as planned so far. You know, they're adding dates to this uh, massive tour. For 2023, uh, you know, again, they're opening up for Metallica on that stadium show that they're going to have. They're going to do a tour uh, in amphitheaters after that. So uh, they're a massive, massive tour here for Pantera. And, and, and with the hint that they are making music behind the scenes um, and, and going to try to release them. Uh, later on but uh hey all all thumbs up for paint hair on this tour so uh that'll be this episode of uh, metalhead nation garage uh, again give us a thumbs up subscribe to the channel